how many hours a day or, or a week would you say you spent in this gym oh when God. you were a student here? A lot, probably more than most people. I uh, I just devoted a lot of my time and energy and life to the sport and to gymnastics while I was here. So um, I used to sleep in the pits sometimes without the coaches knowing, and like just <laughs> I wanted to be here more than anywhere else. So I would say, I mean, I was here at least six days a week, and I would train, you know, four or five hours a day uh, for most most time, and then it kind of increased as I got closer to the Olympics. Take a little, let's take a crack at handstand push-ups. I'm gonna spot you. Same thing. I'm gonna walk around the side. Mm -hmm. So uh, ideally, if you're working um, not against the wall, working against the wall is a good progression, but working with a partner, working with someone that's spotting you is mm -hmm. much more beneficial than just working against the wall. You can get so much more out of working with a partner. You just kind of see what you're doing. One more. Good. Go ahead and kick down. Awesome. How does that feel? Good. Okay. So when I'm spotting you, the advantage there is that I can actually assist you through the motion. Mm -hmm. I can make sure you're getting that full range and staying in a good position and mm -hmm. doing some of the work for you. And as you become better at it, I can kind of let up and you can do more of it on your own. So that's the big advantage. You're, you're staying in a good position when you're with a spotter. And that's mm -hmm. what we want. Technique is critical. Technique, making sure that you're always in that good position is what we're trying to get after. In gymnastics, we're always trying to attain perfection. Everything is about those positions. Okay. All right? The thing I would suggest is that get your head out a tiny bit more. Okay. okay. It's going to allow you to get your elbows in. Right now, your head's a little bit close to your fingertips, so that's why your elbows are going out. So keep them in and try to reach your head out a tiny bit more. So it'll look like more of like a bigger triangle. I know they try to create that shape, hand, hand, head, to create that triangle. Just reach your head out a little bit more to create a longer triangle. Okay. All right? So it'll look more like this. Here. Oh, I see. Okay. So reach your head out a tiny bit more to help create a more stable position. Good, good, good. There you go. Good, awesome. Your position already looks better. Go for it. Keep those elbows in. One more. Good. How'd that feel? Yeah, better. Yeah. Yeah, it's it's gonna create more stability for you. Okay. And one thing that you can work on along with that is kind of that down action. You're just holding a headstand and feel comfortable at that down point. Mm -hmm. Feel comfortable. Okay, where's my head have to be to reach that end point of that push up? All right. Mm -hmm. That was good. Good job. Awesome. Thanks. <laughs>